get in a little information about this? This is uh, number 32 of 50 of the world, only two to the U.S. Of course, I have one in my collection. And, uh, never know. You have the same one. They love our products, so it's like I gotta take care of you. This is a perfect example. We we know uh, Cigar Gin, obviously, for a long time. I see him. He didn't do much with our products before. Uh, they start carrying our agent room, and that has been a success there. We've done some of the great events there, and uh, Fabian uh, has been the participant in that, and that has changed. You know, this has changed the game for us, and this is a perfect example of that. We're writing way more than 100 boxes right now for this because they sent me the new stuff in advance, and I had time to put my feet up and sit in my backyard. Do you know, I didn't know you had received that, and by the way, do you know that you were the first and only people, the only person to try those cigars? I, I was so impressed with all the new offerings. I knew what I wanted when I came to the show. Yeah. Thank you. I didn't have to sell them anything. It was on the best of luck. Good job. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Amazing. That's, that's great, great job. Great that's job. Great. And uh, so the the these we waited, and like I mentioned before, I will have at any given time release a cigar that was okay. We tried this. We have been working on this Maduro for a while. January we had a group. We were working the wild packs. Not ready. Last year we wanted to do it. Last year it was not ready. Listen, guys. We this cigar will have been good last year. It will have been very good in January, but now it is what we wanted. You will try it. We're not releasing cigars that is not at the top. It has it has a sweetness to it, right? Sweetness, creamy. Sweetness to it, the strength. By the way, yesterday, one of our reps, I've been working with us for a long time in Texas, uh, the Polar, he was smoking this cigar in one other booth, come back before the show, come back and say, wow, I feel this. This is like when you have a sweetness drink that has alcohol that it hits you later. This is a cigar that has a lot of strength and it's getting and it's getting at builds. It is not the same when you first light it to when it develops. This is a cigar that will develop. It has a, a lot of body, okay, but it's it's just not one dimension. It's really a multi-dimensional, that's what we're trying to do with any any other brand. It has the first four original blends that we did. The sizes for the M356 is the Presto, the, the, the Rondo, the Mayor, and the Meso. But we added an Alto, which is 47 by 7, which in many of the markets have been asking us. And the last thing I'm going to show you, something we're very proud of. The Swag S. Well, the Swag S is the continued evolution of the Swag line, okay? First of all, let's start with presentation. This is what I said about the looking and the presentation. Look at that. Everything about this cigar, swag was designed as a hip or younger, right, population. And that's what the market looks for, guys. Some of the big companies are doing the small changes to this and that. This is what it is. This is from the beginning. And one of the amazing thing about this, okay, is that one amazing thing about this is, and normally when we do big ring sizes in any manufacturer, you blend the cigar to what you normally blend, the 50s or the 52, which is what the wild pack is, and then you adjust it to higher. Well, on this line, they're all big ring sizes. Up to, up to this massive 70 by seven. And this is the Carter, which by the way is the name of the song that my, won, my son won the Grammy, the first Grammy, the, the album, Dark Carter. We couldn't put a dark water, we put Carter because, you know, obviously there's some uh, issues there. And the swag is represent what is a cigar for new generations. Blended in the big sizes, every one individually, not adjusted to that. So it's different than just adjusting the blend. And all big ring sizes, starting with this. With the total ground, it says 60 by 6.5, and a 54 ring size is available as well. Also, the Nicaraguan Maduro aged about four to five years. In this particular one, it's aged about seven to eight. Uh, Dominican as well, with the touch of the Nicaraguan rum. So this is our new presentation, and to end it, that I see someone smoking here. 
of the minis. And the last thing we introduce is the little mini cigarillos. Now, there are people that like to smoke cigars, no time. And if you get and buy one of these cigarillos, are mild for the majority of the time, things like this and that. But what we did with this, we have been collecting all the tobacco, same tobacco, of the aging room, and now we did this, the aging room meeting. Obviously, we want it to be different, so not a royal tray like everyone else. This tells you quality, an amazing thing. This is like a, a smoking a very small mini. Same tobacco, has body to it compared to the cigarette. So this is our, uh, this is our introduction uh, of all the new lines to you. I appreciate you uh, for taking the time to come here. I hope you try those M21 that you received and the, and the Maduros and try it. And the only thing I will ask, just write what you think it is. If you don't think it's one of the best tones, you know, we not we want you to be honest on that because whatever feedback is helpful, it's very, very helpful, uh, very helpful to us. And uh, everyone will send from our, uh, from our office, uh, understanding that you guys have a little bit of... Uh, a lot of things to carry. We'll send you one of the swag humidors, small humidors, with one of each of the new cigars, and uh, I'll bring you one of these.